Why the heck do Kamala Harris and Tim Walz have guns? Well, back in 2019, Harris told reporters that this was her reasoning. I own a gun for probably the reason that a lot of people do, for personal safety. Um, I was a career prosecutor. It's not entirely surprising since there have been a number of incidents in the past where people in the legal system have tried to retaliate against prosecutors, police, judges, etc. As for Walls, the man absolutely loves hunting and actually used to be one of the NRA's favorite politicians. From around 2010 to 2016, he was a moderate who was a staunch supporter of gun rights, but reformed his stance in 2017 after the Las Vegas Music Festival shooting claimed 60 lives. I think my shift is the country's changed on this. Uh, we've changed. The situation has changed and I along with it as a leader. So what does that mean for their stance on gun legislation? Harris's official policy outline states that as president, she'll ban assault weapons in high capacity magazines, require universal background checks, and support red flag laws. Walls has backed similar measures and as Minnesota governor, signed universal background checks into law, implemented a red flag law, and created stricter penalties for ineligible individuals caught purchasing firearms. Harris and Walls are proof that it's possible for politicians to support popular common sense gun measures without infringing on anyone's rights.